The Indian Railways is all set to purchase trains worth rupees 1 lakh crore as mentioned by Mr. Ashwini Vaishnav, the Railway Minister to ET. He also mentioned that the National Transporter has spent 70% of the 2.4 lakh crores which was allocated to them in the budget for FY24. They will be replacing the aging rolling stock and 7,000 to 8,000 new train sets will be needed. Tenders will be floated in the next 4 to 5 years and this will be honoured in the next 15 years. Investments are set at a target of 12 lakh crores up till 2030 by the railway ministry. The target for the current fiscal year set is set at 5,000 to 6,000 kilometers for new tracks. Now, because of this news, multiple stocks were buzzing. The first one was Tex Maco, which was up over 10% and touched an intra high of 10% uh, by backing an order from railway ministry. The second one was Jupiter Wagons, which also touched an intra day high of 4.5%. The third one is IRFC, which is a dedicated funding arm of railway ministry, which touched an intra high of 8.8%. The fourth one was IRCON, which is a government undertaking under the Ministry of Railways, which touched an intraday high of 3.5%. And lastly, we had Titagar Railway System, which plans to raise QIP worth Rs. 700 crores, and the shares were up 5% in intraday trade today.